all new at noon. We're hearing the 911 calls today in a fire that killed a mother and her two young children early Sunday morning on Ramrod Key. They paint a wrenching portrait of a daughter calling desperate for help. CBS 4's Gary Nelson joins us with the latest on this tragedy. Gary? Well, first, let me tell you, what you're about to hear is heart-wrenching. It is difficult to listen to. You may prefer not to. Investigators say the fire that erupted on the back porch of the second floor of this frame home roared quickly through the house. An eldest daughter who escaped unharmed from a downstairs room called 911. Is anybody in the house? Yes, there are two children and my mother. In the early Sunday dark, 19-year-old Courtney Shores called 911 as fire consumed the upper floor of the family's frame home. They're trapped inside. They can't Do you know if they're awake? Yes, they're screaming. Just break the window. I don't care. Break the window. Trapped upstairs, her mother, Robin Ferrer, half-brother, seven-year-old Roman, and half-sister, five-year-old Hazel. The 911 operator desperately inquires of possible solutions. There's no ladder or anything that they can jump down to? No, they're, they're locked in. They're locked inside. And you do see flames visible, ma'am? The entire house on fire, I can see flames. The fire began on the upstairs back porch of the home and spread quickly. Only one door in and out was blocked by a wall of flames. They're trapped. There's only one way out and it's on fire. The screams from inside the house subsided as the upstairs of the home was rendered charred wood and ashes. 19-year-old son Jacob suffered serious burns attempting to scale the stairs but could not get through the inferno to his mom and half-siblings. In the end, <laughs> the mournful screams of the daughter who had called for help pierced the night knowing her mom and the other children had perished. The tragic lesson in this is to have a backup plan. I spoke this morning with Monroe County Fire Marshal Captain Jim Leonard, who said you and your family should have an emergency alternative. If the door or doors to your home are blocked by fire, identify windows you can jump through, even from an upper floor, as in this case, better, the fire marshal said, to break an ankle or a leg in the fall than to lose your life. Now, the cause of Sunday's fire remains under investigation, and foul play has not been ruled out. Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News.